Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my video on how to properly use sucrose. This guide will show you how to achieve max usability in DPS with your sucrose and in no time at all, you'll have a god tier character. Free to play by the way. So uh, yeah, let's dive right into it. Now, uh, first of all, we are going to talk about elemental mastery because this is a very important aspect of sucrose. So uh, yeah, we're going to be going to our stats list. We're going to be going to attributes and details. And here, as you can see here, we have elemental mastery. And it says here, the higher a character's elemental mastery, the stronger the elemental energy that can be released. Basically saying, this elemental energy is elemental reactions. And as you can see here, it actually does increase, increases damage. As you can read here, increases damage caused by vaporize and melt by 12.9%. But uh, that one doesn't interest us right now. We're going to be going right for this part here, the second part. The third part actually which is also increases damage caused by overloaded superconduct electro charge shattered and swirl by 31 percent by swirl guys because as you like as you guys probably do know already sucrose is an, an emo character and her main specialty her main elemental reaction is swirl so uh what this 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 swirl right here like as far as elemental mastery goes this swirl like the swirl damage that sucrose will be having it's going to be very useful so uh yeah let's go dive right into the spiral abyss and get started we're going to be showcasing like a swirl and all that we're going to be showcasing how to properly use sucrose with swirl so I'm just gonna knock Sucrose right into it, and yeah, off you go to Spiral Abyss. So, here we go, here we go, just knock on whatever buffs you've got. So now, first thing you must know, first thing you must know for, for swirling, for swirling, massive tip guys, okay? So, always try to alternate between enemies, because there is a cooldown between elemental reactions. There's always a cooldown between elemental reactions. Wait, as you can see, wait, I'm gonna select one character, swirl, swirl, s that one. And you can see that there's no swirl coming up, there's no elemental reaction that has come up, okay? Now, second tip that you guys would want to do is to use your elemental skill first and then use your elemental burst. What this one does is that it uh, regenerates your energy much faster. And right after that, you can follow up with another elemental skill. And right after that, guys, you can see actually that my elemental burst is almost ready to use. It is almost like totally ready to use right now. And uh, just put knock in that one. There we go. There we go. And there. So you've guys seen exactly how that how to use uh, sucrose by herself with swirls and all that but now we're going to be going on how to use her as a team now this one here this one will focus on how to use swirl to your advantage and how to infuse enemies with elements to aid in that swirl so we're going to be going up here that one and okay so now first thing you guys must know is that this one uh, can uh, like you'll have to bring characters that can infuse enemies with elements and basically you can do tons of elemental reactions not not only swirl but tons of reactions like overload or uh or melt or vaporize all those kinds of reactions we're going to be going up right now we're going to be testing these ones out in a jiffy so we're going to knock in barbara we're going to knock in shangling and probably we're going to knock in oz like we're gonna be not what Oz official. So now we're gonna jump right into it. We're gonna be jumping right into it. Okay, and here we go. So now guys, as you can see here, we're gonna be doing quite a lot of reactions, okay? So now first things first, with Barbara, you can literally just go walk right to them and that one infuses them this one will infuse them uh, with the said element now use that one that one that one you can actually just go right 
Now next, you can actually use Xianglings. See? Like that. Like that. Or you can actually use that. Barbara. And now Sucrose. And you can use all of that elemental reactions for big, big, big damage. You can use all of that on you. You've seen how many elemental reactions we just did. So basically, guys, what what you should do normally is to try as much as you can to augment your output of swirl swirls. That's one thing that you must do for sucrose to get as many swirls in as possible. And since you're going to be putting her in a team, try to get as many elemental reactions as possible. Thanks for watching, guys.